video may not be suitable for all viewers. This content is aimed towards adults and adults who are not easily triggered over harmless fiction and knows how to separate harmless fiction from reality. We are not responsible for you getting triggered. You have been warned. Ooh woo! Hey, what's up everyone? It is I, the Video Game Hunter, and welcome to another VGH Let's Play. And today, we are taking a look at another Legend of Zelda Light game for the VR called Aragon, made by Repulse Games. So, that said, let's go and take a look. You didn't really spit, did you? You just want to act cool when you walked in. So, what makes you think you have what it takes to squire for the Frontier Guard? Well, becoming a knight has been a dream of mine since I was young. A knight? Do you have any highborn relatives we can verify? No, but I'm a really fast learner. I've trained in my spare time, so it's not like I don't know how to use a sword. Look, we don't need anyone in the kitchen staff right now, and that is the most we could ever offer someone with a background like yours. Please, if you just give me a chance, I could... Well, I guess I didn't get the job. They kicked me out. Bunch of ass. Oh, cute babes. Nice. I'm very easily distracted. I can I can have a full-blown conversation that I'm... And I see something very adorable, and I have to look at it. Man, hopefully this is a sit-down game, so I don't have to stand up. That would be kind of great, to be honest. But I'm not going to hold my breath. I probably will have to change position and stand up. And then I have to reorganize my camera and my recording equipment. Hey, you know where I can find Gintis? Ooh. The merchant from Reistad. He arrived around two weeks ago. Oh, him! Last I saw him, he was arguing with some guy in the tavern. Okay, go to the tavern. Thanks. That actually I'll go helps. See if he's still there. Eric, there you are. Look, I need the pay you promised me. Of course, of course. Here you are. Two gold shillings. Two? But we had agreed on nine. Times are very tough right now. With the approaching war and all, I'm still paying you more than anyone else would for simply delivering a letter. War? Wait, that's not fair. Neither is life. Figure something out, kid. Well, that sucks. You screwed me over. I'm gonna slap you. I'm gonna slap me. Can I get close to you to slap? I slap you. You... I slap you, you owe me seven coins. How dare you fuck me over? But then again, we're in war. Is it true? The war I'm hearing about. I'm afraid so. A royal messenger was here this morning. I'm not sure why he hasn't delivered the news to the stronghold yet. What did he say? It's not good. A massive imperial army is marching through the southern border. Every attempt made to halt their advance has failed. The southern border. That's... That's where my parents live. I need to help them. Sorry to say, but... I don't see that happening. Maybe, but... What else am I supposed to do? It's my family. <sighs> Here's what. Go to the nearby farm and talk with the owner. If someone can help you reach the border in time, it's him. Great. I'll go find him. Thank you. Good luck. Just follow the signs. You'll be there in no time. All right, let's go. Where's my sword? I don't. Great, the sword ain't is not on me. I was going to make a violent post saying, "Let's go and rescue my family," but I guess that ain't going to happen. Damn it. All right, so let's follow. 
this first step, so it'll take me to my next main quest, I guess. Now, I have my sword. Let's go and rescue my family from the evil villains. Hiya! I threw that way farther than I, I threw that way farther this time. All right, let's see. I can let's see. I can outdo my throw. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let me do it one more time. I swear I can do outdo it. Ugh. Oh well. Anyway, let's go rescue my family. What the dog is? All right. I guess he said to the farm. Right. Is there any way I can look, at, like, at a journal reminding me where to go? Oh, I guess not. That's not an option. I mean, I, this game is kind of like the Elder Scroll games, like Morrowind or Oblivion. But in those games, you have a journal so you can keep track on the quests you need to complete. But this game does not have it. I like, uh, hopefully they add something like that into this game so I it can remind myself saying, hey, you still have these things to do. But anyways, I do know that I have to go to the farmlands. And I think it's this way. To the farmlands. Web swing. Web swing. Can I throw this straight up, by the way? Ah, yeah. Kinda, yeah! Oh, I'm sorry, this is so- can I do both hands? Fwa! Yes, I can! Grabbing you. Grabbing you. Three, two, one, and... Woo! Ho oh, ho! I'm sorry, I'm having way too much with this. This is so cool. And can I do it both at the same time? Really cool. Ha! Huh. Bye, sword. Uh, uh, uh. Ba, ba. Boo, 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 boo. Okay, boo, 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 boo. And, yeah, that's really cool. Oh. Come on, let me throw. I was enjoying the game so much until you showed up. Come on! How long do I have to do this? This is a Zelda game I was talking about when I was doing my Adventure Time Let's Play. Woo! Alright! Except I am not using the keyboard, I'm actually using my motion control. Ah, take that. Uh, uh, I think I hurt him with my magic. Uh oh. Sexy, sexy enemy chick in trouble. Let's go and save her. As a white knight, it's my job to do so. I rescue the sexy pink hair lady. Are you alright? I... I think so. If you hadn't, they... Hey, don't worry. They're gone now. Thank you. What happened? Did they attack you? Did the main character's voice just suddenly change? I think it did. And guess what? As we further go along with this video, more characters voice will suddenly change which I thought was kind of odd. So anyway, continuing on. I don't know. I was traveling home when they came out of nowhere. I thought they were bandits. I've never seen bandits with armor like this before. They might be foreign soldiers. Do you think there's more of them? I'm not sure, but it's getting dark. You're not safe out here on your own. We could at least find a good place to spend the night. You might be right. Stay close. I promise I'll protect you. Oh! 
Uh, cool. She, she somewhat likes me. I guess that's a good thing. Erica, go to the camp to interact with Erica. Okay. Where's the camp? Oh, wow. Well, check out our camp. It's pretty badass. Oh, uh, I guess those are locked. I guess we have to wait until the game gets updated or we might have to do something extra special like join the Patreon or something. No, well, I'm sure no guarantee, but right now I'm saying maybe you have to wait for uh, uh, some kind of s update to see these characters. Now, I would say this, my only complaints is that uh, I don't think I don't think realistic male characters really fit the anime females. Uh, that's my personal opinion. Either make both male or females more anime-like, or I guess really don't do it at all. Because realistic, something realistic mixed in with the anime characters seems so out of place. What's up, my fine lady? Thanks for saving my life. I'm Erica, but I'm not sure you told me your name. Derek, I think I've seen you in the village before. How are you holding up? Still a little bit shaken up, but I think I'll be fine now that we're safe. Yeah, I don't mean to pry, but what were you doing in the woods anyway? I was bringing supplies to my family. They live not too far ahead, outside the village, so I usually help them out. It's never been dangerous before. Not until now, at least. Can you help me reach them? Who knows what else is lurking out there? Sure, I don't see why not. I don't see why not. I'm going in the same direction anyway. I keep thinking about what could have happened if you hadn't shown up. No, don't worry about that. It's behind us now. Yeah. I'm here. I won't let anything bad happen to you. Is that a promise? It is. Thank you. All right. Oh, whoa. I wasn't expecting that at all. Touch her. Um, okay, how about a head pat? <laughs> okay, there you go. You got a head pat. Uh, okay. I'll touch your arm. Okay. Oh no, the way she's leaning forward and stuff looks really awkward, not gonna lie. <laughs> and now I get a better look at the model. Hmm. Oh no, the head. I don't know, maybe it's just me, but maybe the head doesn't really fit the body that much. The body doesn't look, I guess. Anime-ish enough, if that makes sense. But anyway, I'm done giving her a head pat, <laughs> so let's go and leave her. Oh, it's daytime now. So now I guess, assuming we can move forward. You know, for a camp that was so big, uh, that area is very small. So I'm assuming we got teleported to a magical camping site that allowed us to interact with new people and stuff. Hey, at least my uh, magic and health got leveled up. That's the good news. What is that though? That's a lantern. Uh, it does nothing, but I made a field goal. All right. And my palms are getting sweaty now. So that means I'll probably have to wipe these controls down when I get done with this game, no joke. Magic really helps. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, dude. casting magic, swinging a sword around, so much fun. I'm not lying. Oh, but what were they doing? Why were they worshiping this wolf? 
Let me try that again. There we go. No, I forgot there's a jump button. Is that a duck button? No, that's a 180 turn. No, I guess that helps a bit. <sighs> oh, it doesn't say, listen, what's going on with that chair? Can I select it? Oh. That, I did that totally by accident and I blew up the chair. Pretty cool, huh, sweetie? <laughs> wow, I really did not mean to blow up that chair, but that's still pretty cool. All right, let's go after that guy. He needs to be killed next. Alrighty then. Here we go. Buddy, ready to fight? How come you get a shield? Good time to pass up. Oh no, wait. Lightning bolt! 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 Sleep! Lightning bolt! 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 Lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. And I just could not pass up that mean. Lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! So I guess in collecting this magic sphere actually will help me raise my stats up. Well, for magic and health for the time being. Look, another treasure chest. Oh, hey. Why aren't you moving? Come on, I'm throwing fireballs at you. Oh, cool, another camping site. Let's see, wasn't that box though? Oh, I, th I think I'm pulling a muscle doing all that throwing. It was my little one go. Huh. Guess she couldn't jump down. Let's trigger to enter the camp, which I will. Another sexy lady in a bikini. Or in her underwear, in a way. Alright, there's my fine lady, right there. Let's see if we can raise my stats up. Hello, good fine sir. You're a black guy being a blacksmith. You find that kind of ironic? Alright. Oh, wow, I collect a lot of these things. Okay, I maxed out my um, health and mana. Hopefully, when officially the game comes out, I don't get to level up so easily. Oh, other than that, they will raise up the uh, level bar. All right, and I can't... Oh, what did I... Oh, I did unlock some things. I upgraded my fireball, cool. Let's leave. I can't 
can't believe we're still alive. Yeah. I didn't think the woods would have gotten that dangerous. I don't wish to sound ungrateful. I appreciate all that you've done. Why are you still helping me? You keep getting yourself in danger because of me. To keep your promise, because I said I would help you. I wouldn't just leave you. I gave you my word. That's true. But what makes me so special? I... I... What do you mean? I've seen the way you look at me, Derek. Um... I... You've done so much for me already. Let me show you my gratitude. There what? Oh, no! Okay! This is totally gonna be censored in the editing room. Yes, sir! That's okay. At least she's at least she's giving consent, and that's all that matters. But the uh, touching de detecting is not that good, so no. I'm not really mentioning much. What are you doing? Oh, I think I. I think I tried to touch someone that she didn't like, but okay. But anyway, not much to see here. Let's go ahead and move on. They need to work on the touch mechanics, because... Mm, I'm not really enjoying it that much. Gosh, I think a good example to look at the touch mechanics is... uh. Villain Simulator, they got that thing down easily. And that's mostly because that's the main focus of the game. To torture them, touch them, do whatnot. Yeah. They got that touch mechanic down easily. So yeah, despite the fact I don't really recommend Villain Simulator on the Villain Simulator game, I still recommend them using their example of how to touch characters correctly. Alright, so let's let's leave this area. Oh, well, you know, you're finally down here. But who's that lady right there? She's just standing there, menacingly. He's just standing there, menacingly! She must be wanted. Let's go kill her. Now, die, villain! Uh, 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 uh. Well, you're not getting hurt, so I'm assuming you are not the villain. Oh, right, let's talk to you. April, go to camp to interact with April. But I know nothing about her. Why did she decide to join us? Like, no interaction at all. So go back to camp and interact with her then. Let's go. Okay, April, you look like a gypsy, but I'm gonna give you a chance. Who exactly are you? Slay the witch, and I'll be yours. That's such a shit voice acting. We you mean, View Gallery? We got nothing. But you want me to slay the witch? You might have a fine gypsy dress, but my god. I know absolutely zero about you. But whatever, I'm not going to question the game. They can update this game to explain the situation about you later on. If you can fight, you can fight. So follow me then. Well, I don't have my sword out. Oh. Oh, I guess some people can throw fireballs now. Oh. His fireballs might be more powerful than mine. 
Let's go to the blacksmith. Hey, I need you to work on my magic. Uh, I know it doesn't make sense, but according to this game, you have to work on my magic so I can get stronger. All right, all right. so I master fire now. Upgrading my ice, cool. But let's leave. Thank you, fire and good sir. I don't know how you being a blacksmith working on my magic makes it makes me stronger, but I ain't gonna question this game. And I believe you're the only blacksmith in the whole video game series out there that only upgrades my magic by going through blacksmithing. Anyway, let's see what this gypsy has to say. Anything new, gypsy? Prove yourself to me, and I could be yours. Nah, I think I'm good, little one. Oh my gosh, let's go see that ice dragon right there. That looks badass. Is she a boss? Or is she going to be another follower? Wait, why are my hands over there? Uh, yes, you're a gigantic. What are you going to do to me? And there you have it, folks. That was Eragon for the VR. And for what I have to say is that this game, for the most part, is pretty fun. I really enjoy playing this game. But now I will say this. It still needs a lot of work, obviously. And this game is still in the pre-alpha. But I will say this. Um... The controls works pretty well, the sword swinging, throwing the magic, but the magic can also feel a bit off when you're trying to throw it. So it needs some tweaking for that. And, but I think that my main concern is that um, the touching mechanics when you touch the female characters, um, that could be worked on a bit because it still feels off and not really natural compared to other VR games I've played in the past, like Villain Simulator. The touching mechanics in that game actually works pretty well despite the game that I don't really recommend. But um, if you want to take some notes, try this game out and see uh, what they do can improve upon your game. Um, one thing I will also say is that when I do th um, throw my magic at an enemy, um, for, for whatever odd reason, sometimes they don't respond when I actually hit them with my magic. You might want to tweak on their response when someone actually throws something at them. Because, come on. Who the hell doesn't- who the hell doesn't respond when something's getting thrown at them? Give them some kind of reaction or something, or like, Hey, who threw that? Oh, you threw it. Oh, I'm coming after you now. S something along those lines. But, I will also say, um... I, I think this game could use some music, Leon. I think this game feels a bit too quiet at times. Either the music is too low or you forgot to add music. But I will say this, I guess add music or raise the volume. But that said, um, I really enjoyed this game. I recommend checking this game out. There's also a non-VR version on their itch.io page, which I will leave a link down below. And for those who want to support the game, I don't think they have a Patreon page or only support page they have. But uh, according to the itch.io page for this game, they will be releasing a Kickstarter at some point. I will also leave a link down below. No, it's not launched yet, but they will be releasing at some point. So keep an eye out for that. So that said, thank you so much for everyone for watching. This is the Video Game Hunter. And until next time, goodbye. I like